Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. In our last tutorial, we made this graphene supercell, right? So today, we'll convert this supercell to LAMS data file. But to do that, we need a software named Atomscape. So to download Atomscape, go to your browser and you can find it here. I will put the link in the description. And according to your operating system, you can download it. I've already downloaded the software, so I'm not downloading it again. Now, you need to save your Vesta file as a .cif file. So export data, and you can see that I've chosen .cif file. You can also choose any other file you want, but .cif is convenient. So desktop and save. Now, as we have exported the data, that means all the atomic positions are exported already. Now we need to convert the file. That's it. So go to your search and search PowerShell. There you go, PowerShell. Just open it. And as we have, as you have, uh, set up atom scan. So now let me set the location to desktop. Set location desktop done and you can see the location is set to desktop now let's run this graphene.cif file in atoms atoms graphene.cif labs that's it that's the code you can see it's successfully terminated and this is the directory where my atomske exe is and this is the code this is the file name and the format name which i want to convert it this is our required file this is the data file let's open it so you can see we have 50 atoms and all the data of atoms provided here you can also open it in ovito so let's see it in Ovito. I prefer this method. You can also run Ovito and then you can just drag and drop it. Ovito DXC. So there you go. There is our graphing structure. That's all for today. See you soon.